What's going on? Another episode of Kyle TV, and in this episode, we're obviously just talking about Bitcoin and the overall altcoin market and how the altcoins are literally like, I mean, it's a bloodbath out there right now. So Bitcoin right now has went up all the way to roughly nineteen thousand dollars and seven hundred, nineteen thousand seven hundred. So. Um, Obviously, that wasn't sustainable, so it's pulled back quite a bit. Um, I'm on the one-minute chart right here. So, you know, congrats to everybody that capitalized on this run-up. But it looks like it's starting to stabilize a little bit. Um, it's reached its lowest low around the 1,500 level, um, and it's rebounded, and it's trying to find um, a little more support there. So um, we'll kind of monitor this, but taking a look at the overall market, CryptoKitties and the Ethereum network has gone down. No surprise there. I don't know if that's directly related. But overall, we're looking at a market cap of $418 billion right now. So the market cap, cap has continued to grow, uh, to keep growing. Um, we're seeing 60, almost 65% Bitcoin dominance right now, which is insane. So um, I don't know if we'll see this thing drop off, you know, in the next hour or so. But Bitcoin's dominance is almost at 65%, which is insane. It's, that's the highest it's been in a while. So, you know, we're going to scroll down here. As, you know, we see these bigger whales, if Bitcoin starts, you know, petering out, you know, and the market starts turning, you'll see bigger whales start to get back into their altcoin positions. Bitcoin cash down. IOTA down, that might be a good buy because it's already ran all the way up, especially right now. It's being tested at $3, so down 18% on the day. So that might be a good buy because, like I said, it's already seen its run up. Bitcoin's dominance is all the way up, so this may be the bottom of IOTA for a while. So maybe a good time to get into IOTA at such a cheap price, but we'll see here in the next couple hours what Bitcoin does. Um, we're on the one minute chart. It's at 16,200. Um, a few red bars trying to find support around that area, it looks like. Dash all the way down to 680. Uh, Bitcoin gold crushing da down below $260. Um, it was over 300 just recently. Crazy stuff. Monero. Might be a good time to get a Monero. Monero has is being tested as well. It's been up, has a nice run, corrected, and it's down even more. So it might be a good time to get into Monero. Um, so Litecoin, pretty stable actually. You know, it you know has crossed down uh, below 100, but overall not too bad. Cardano, one of my favorites, is down to 11 cents. Um, that may be the bottom of a Cardano. I don't see it going below 11 cents, and if it does, that's a great buy area, in my opinion. Now, I'm not a financial advisor, so I can't advise you on what to, to buy or sell anything, but this is my, you know, um, this is my entertainment advice from YouTube, um, but you know what I mean. So, Stellar Lumens holding pretty strong around 13. Um, BitConnect has soared, um, absolutely just soared, so... Um, but yeah, so we won't talk about BitConnect too much there. Um, Ethereum Classic. I can't believe Ethereum Classic has gone up so much, but it's down as well. I mean, I was looking at this coin when I was like $13, 11 11 you know, 11 to $13, so that's pretty insane. EOS, that might be another good buy. It's seen its run up, and it's down. Um, EOS, very solid project. Could overtake Ethereum is what people are trying to say about EOS. Um, others, we got Monacoin, Quantum, Stratus, Lisk. Actually, Stratus has gone up. It uh, looks like it's Bitcoin resistant. A lot of whales may have gotten in this when it dipped. So uh, time will tell on that. Steam, $1.52. Tron actually has gone up like amazingly. I mean, I made a video about it the other day. Um, but they actually had news come out that they partnered with some company to increase like the basically the you know shared 
how what they're doing at Tron is basically decentralizing, you know, creative content. And so they partnered up with a company there. So good news on Tron. Um, this thing, you know, if it reaches one cent, you'll have made your money there uh, with them. Might be a little high at this price right now. Um, but, you know, good news for Tron. So Cycoin, Golem, 10X, all these companies. Uh, Power Ledger, that's another one that's been, everybody's been talking about Power Ledger recently. Um, it decentralizes um, energy usage and basically, you know, decentralizes the energy community into where you buy energy on it as a need, like an as needed basis with your cryptocurrency. So that might be something to look out to. You can go to the website, watch that video, what it's all about. Um, it's down to 56 cents. That might be a cheap price when we're looking at this in a year or two from now. Um, let's see, Walton Coins down, Bitcoin dark. We got Basic Attention. Basic Attention announcing that they're going to give like 30 uh, bat tokens if you basically download the browser, the Brave browser, which is you know um, a basically anonymous type of browser that lets you surf the web and pay creative, um, you know content makers through basic attention tokens and things like that so there's that um, we have zcoin v chain funfair we got all these other coins that you know down here below verge up actually three percent i think that's like another privacy coin there um, substratum down 39 cents might be okay to buy that i don't know if it's going to bottom out um, that might be the lowest it goes. So anyways, the altcoins for sure are getting tested right now. Let's go ahead and refresh and see with the Bitcoin dominance. Yep, it looks like it's reversing right now. Um, you know, this price is coming down. People are starting to get back into their all position. So this might be the time right now to, you know, hurry Cardano back under 11 cents. It hasn't been under that, that price area in a while. So that might be something to look at if you guys are wanting to get in on a coin long term that's affordable right now. You know, a year or two from now, we might be seeing, you know, that that was a dirt cheap price to get in on. Um, you know, so Cardano has a nice run. People started to figure out what Cardano actually was, um, especially with the Ethereum network, you know, being the way it was. And, you know, one crypto kitty, you know, thing kind of lagging up 60 percent of the the uh, transaction network. You know, people are starting to put money into these other projects like EOS and Cardano and IOTA, especially IOTA. Um, so that's why Cardano has saw that massive run corrected. And we saw market price you know, hold strong around the 12, 13 cent area. And of course, with Bitcoin's run, it's down to 11 cents again. It's already back up to 11 cents. So looks like whales are moving on that price action and that price area. So pretty yep it's already back up there um, as that was you know a low buy so um, if you watch my video before that on Cardano you know my thoughts about it I think it's awesome um, the people behind it are really great um, so but yeah that's what I got for this quick video wanted to shoot it right now we are live right now as of 12 we're almost 12 p.m. Central Standard Time in America so and we are watching this thing it's back up so we'll see this Bitcoin dominance and see what uh, the price action and everything like that. Um, but 65, almost 65% of the entire crypto market. That's insane, guys. And these coins are holding strong. You know, we're growing. The cryptocurrency market just keeps growing, growing, growing. Um, you know, pretty soon we'll be looking at $500 billion uh, market cap on the entire cryptocurrency market. So with that being said, guys. Make sure you get in on your altcoins before it's too late. And when this thing starts, you know, petering out, we might already be seeing that right now in transition in this video. But, um, you know, obviously you want to keep holding Bitcoin for the long term. I'm not saying get out of Bitcoin. I'm just saying, you know, if you have extra money laying around, you might want to put it into these some of these altcoins before they go back up. So, guys, with that being said, I'm going to end this video and... I hope you have a, a great rest of your day. Um, subscribe to this channel. Hit the notification bell. Leave a comment related to this, this video and maybe even your wallet address because I'll be giving away Bitcoin 
um, a small amount of Bitcoin to those who are leaving comments below. That's all you got to do. And I'll pick a random commenter. Um, and I still got to announce one of the winners in a previous video as well in my next video. So with that being said, guys, I will see you later and in the next video and at the blockchain later.